Mr. Grinch, you really are a heel. Welcome to another Christmas in July. Second annual. Second annual Christmas in July celebration well, on, on Flipped. Yes, and we'll link up below somewhere the last video we just did. Well, we didn't just do it, it was last year. But we'll link up the video of last year's Christmas in July, inspired by Ears to You. So shout out to them. And just like them, we're going to Five and Below and we're gonna get each other gifts. So some Christmas gifts. $10, no more than $10. So what's cool about Five and Below is that you can get 10 $1 items, you can get $2 items, $5 items, that's about it, right? So, you know, it just depends. Five dollars below. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. So, but I mean, that's the whole point. You can get a really cool gift, or you can Hopefully, get. Hopefully, I've never been there. A bunch I don't of even small know what stuff. We're gonna see. They have cool stuff. So, last year we did it. We did it at the dollar store. Um, yeah. And I felt oh, like it was yeah. harder. So, I think it's gonna be easier getting stuff over here. So, let's see. It's a rainy day today. It's a perfect day for Christmas in July. Yeah. So we're going to use these storage bins to hide the gifts from each other. So, see you later. Bye. Should I get my cookbook? Well, this is appropriate. I spotted him. This looks like fun. This is definitely harder than it looks. I was really considering getting this, but I don't know. <laughs> I have a feeling he's never gonna use it, but it would be funny. Also, they have shower speakers here. So it's a raining. So how much did you spend? How much did you spend? That's Blumhouse, Truth yeah. or Dare. We're thinking of renting Truth or Dare from the Redbox. Mm -hmm. And what was the other one? Ready, ready oh, Player One. Yeah, ready player. Now we're at Publix and we're going to buy some ingredients to make a festive quiche. A holiday quiche. I know, kombucha is like the newest trend now. There's so many. Oh, I've, I've heard about this one. Power Greens. We're gonna try a new kombucha. Are these all criminals? Yeah. Is that really what it is? It's called prisoner. I mean, age 30 days in rum barrels. I think we need to do it. Oh, this is about Australia. So now we found a cream cheese with probiotics in it. That's so bizarre. Everything has probiotics now. <laughs> Only buy happy eggs. Should we get Santa's White Christmas since it's, Chris that since it's Christmas in July? Is that flavored? It's actually just a medium roast coffee, but it's like $9. It's kind of expensive. How much is, how much is it at um, Trader, at Trader Joe's? Joe's you can like get for like, $7? yeah. And they got buy one, get one freeze here for Publix. Time to make a quiche. So the first thing I gotta do is make a low carb pie crust that I found using almond flour. And then I can make the actual quiche. I cooked it all the way through, which is the hard part about this, not knowing. Does it look like a quiche? I think so. <laughs> it's just like, it has a lot going on. <laughs> it looks like a messy quiche. <laughs> well, we'll taste it. So this is my first time making like a quiche with a crust. Usually I don't make a crust. Um, I usually make like a frittata, more like it. But this one has turkey, sausage with fennel and cranberry in it, tomatoes, collard greens, spinach, onions, tomatoes, I said that already, cheese. Yeah. So it's just like, it's really heavy duty, it's got a lot of stuff going on in there. But it's came out pretty good. Do you approve? I like it. It does taste, it does remind me of Christmas. <laughs> it reminds you of Christmas? Good. What do you think, Coco? Alright, 
So, this is the portion of the video where we're gonna open presents next to our Charlie Brown Christmas tree. And they see it. See. I see the little birdie. Let me. We got our little Charlie Brown Christmas tree since we're not gonna actually, go, you know, go through the effort of putting up the whole entire Christmas tree. We got our Coco Claus here. He's ready. He delivered the presents. <laughs> and we're gonna open our presents. Uh oh. Merry Christmas! And we're going to the beach soon. And, oh, okay. So I thought you could use a towel. And this is the most boyish one I saw, and it says reserved. What? Like reserved, like for you. Oh, like the. Like, the, like it's your. Steal my towel. Yeah, like this is reserved, like my spot oh. for when you leave the water. You know what I mean? Okay. Part of. Yeah. Oh. Because wow, every time you come that. to my car, you don't have sunglasses. So cool and look good. Yeah. I don't think these are gonna break either. I don't know, all your sunglasses break, so it might break, but <laughs> for now at least. Yay! I love Christmas in July. Oh, this is cute! This matches the... The lady in the kitchen. The lady in the kitchen. Now, oh, I love it. I was thinking to put it somewhere in the, in the kitchen. In the kitchen somewhere, yeah. yeah. This is cool, I like this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How they could do Christmas it's in July. It's Christmas! <laughs> this will be my pajamas tonight. This piece, this is super silly. I just thought we could use it tonight and it'll be fun. So you, they're like little rock, like helicopter LED little rockets and you light them and you like throw them into the air and they like fly and they have lights. Okay. And I thought it would look cool. Like we could just tonight like test them out and see like, yeah, five and below is not the best place for men. It's definitely like highly girly. I feel like there was a lot and of girl kiddie. stuff. You and can get a lot of stuff. kid stuff there. There wasn't a lot of man stuff. It was like difficult. Was, I was looking, there was no kitchen section either. Yeah, there was, I, I was looking at the cookbook. Oh <laughs> he thinks it's for him. Man, you, you're better at this than I am. This is awesome. I was even looking at these things thinking about how cool it would be to have this like hung up somewhere. I definitely like wanted there was a few I want options. more lights. I wasn't sure. No, this is I awesome. I thought that was like, most universal. That's what I had to go back and get. Ah, thank you. <laughs> He's gonna get glitter all over his face. Try. There you go. <laughs> There's Come something on, in there. Hands. Look. <laughs> all he cares about is food, so that's, you know. Well, we got the little lights going. Put them down here for now because I think they look cool. Right, Coco? Mm -hmm. Coco Claus. <laughs> he he puts up with so much. <laughs> so now we got this lady over here hanging out next to this lady. I got my new Christmas shirt on. Thanks to Five and Below. What is that? Coco. So last Christmas, I bought this at Trader Joe's. It's a ginger house, gingerbread German house kit. And I really am excited to do it, but this one doesn't want to do it. I know it's a lot of work. Sometimes gingerbread houses, whoa. Sometimes gingerbread houses can be a lot of work. And I, I know it's Christmas in July. We're gonna do it. I bought this literally because I was like, we did such a horrible job with the last time we tried to do a ginger house that we had, we had that one recorded, right? We have that it, yeah. One. I'll link it up below. Alright, so we open it up. We got this powdered sugar. Here's the actual gingerbread. We got the candies. This is the thing to put the icing into. A oh, little people. Oh. <laughs> the little people? What is... <laughs> I'm glad we don't have to make them ourselves. Oh, wow. They are little peoples. The little family. And the dog. <laughs> That's so cute. I didn't expect that. So we're gonna do this gingerbread house thing. So um, we got our coffees, yeah. our Christmas coffees. Cheers! The things I I get him to do is amazing. <laughs> I have no problem drinking coffee. <laughs> well, we haven't made it yet. We so. got our little humans, our little people. Cute. We got candies. Well, I should like just. We got cocoa. We should just like put this down so you can see. So here we got the gingerbread pieces. 
And then here we have the icing and I had to whip egg whites to do this and mix it with powdered sugar. My hands just got dirty, so can you try to cut it yeah. for me? I don't know how thick. We're already in the, off to a really good start compared to last time we did this. Yeah, they didn't give us instructions last time, right? Yeah, I think we just didn't know what we were doing and we didn't have icing, it was like, well, we did. I don't I remember think, what happened with the icing. I think they gave the us the icing. Like, I don't know. Turn it so that people can see what's going on. So we got the base down. Now I just need to fill it up with icing. Interesting other side of the house. <laughs> we ran out of decoration. <laughs> well, they only give you like a few of these little jelly looking things. And they give you a lot of these, but then these make a mess. And they only work if the icing is wet. Here's our little gingerbread German house. It's the little dogs. Is that a dog or a reindeer? I don't know. But the way they did it like that. Like they had the dog just hanging on the roof, so. I don't know. That's a little. <laughs> Fluffy tail. <laughs> and then uh, one side of the roof is decorated somewhat and the other side is not. But honestly, what's going on right here is pretty pretty decent. Yeah. The tree looks horrible. Honestly, I think we did better than last year, so I really like this form of gingerbread better. And the yeah. look the little kids have their presents. They brought fruits. <laughs> <laughs> they all have a little they fruit. Threw it at the roof. And they threw and they all that's what happened. That's the story. The kids threw the fruits at the roof and TP'd the house. The father decapitated. Oh that yeah, he's boy decapitated. With, with the little stick that the I little just had to squeeze. That that's why he's leaning against the tree. But that has a weapon. Oh <laughs> We did it! Christmas in July! Woohoo! We're so good. We're so good at Christmas. <laughs> Top this during actual Christmas. Next Christmas we should, well next Christmas in July, we should do Christmas cookies for ourselves instead of Santa Claus. <laughs> we should do healthy Christmas cookies for ourselves since Santa Claus ain't coming in July. Yeah? Yeah. We do that all the time already, but, but we, gotta we do need to do something that's Christmas cookies. special. Oh, okay. Or we'll, we'll think of something to step up our game. We'll, we'll think of something. Yeah. We'll do, we'll do something different. Now we gotta try out the little helicopters. I wanna try out, the, I wanna see how they look outside. It's wine time live. We're gonna have that prisoner wine. We got Christmas jazz music playing, so festive. And look, the Tim trackers are right there. Jingle juice. No more? A little tinny bit, thanks. What do you got here? A little bit of flavor, see some liquid in the pan, and then we'll add the rest of our ingredients. Which Florida theme park would you go to? What possibilities Magic Kingdom Park on W Mon Railway in Bay Lake? Is that the one you're looking for? Sure. Okay, so we are about to light the uh, helicopters. Okay. <laughs> coming. Right. What? Where'd it go? Oh. oh. Come on. Okay. Oh. Really work. Oh, okay. I didn't even. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing screams Christmas more than a horror movie. <laughs> Truth or dare. But first, we're gonna watch Ready Player One. So let's see. The challenge is to find three keys, but in five. What the hell's a caracol? It's a bomb. It kills every avatar on the planet, even the owner. Who's that? <laughs> Really put the pedal 